Found out my wife cheated with
No idea what I want to accomplish with my life. Like a result, I've gone to you for advice, just as so many others have done before me. Because I don't want to be around her right now. She had to leave on a work trip for a few days, which was really good timing because I'm just sitting here wallowing in self-pity and thinking what to do next. I admire and respect this woman with all of my heart, yet I also loathe her at the moment. What would you do? Is the question I'm posing to you all. Divorce seems to be a straightforward option, but I'm having trouble wrapping my brain around it right now. Isn't it true that people come back after being betrayed? Is she, in fact, a horrible person from whom I should distance myself in order to concentrate on restarting my life? I'm at a loss for words. I'm at a loss on what to do. On the plus side, it makes me appreciate how easy my life has been in comparison to other situations, and I'm at a loss for what to do in this situation. Thank you for reading this and taking the time to do so. Please accept my apologies if this was too long or confusing at any point. I needed to get things off my chest and out of my thoughts in order to begin thinking about the next steps. Everyone on this list is in my thoughts and prayers. Update. I learned that my wife was having an extramarital affair at the beginning of 2019. In our relationship, we were dealing with a lot of issues that were probably never going to be addressed, and the affair was the last straw. In spite of the fact that it took us a few months to come to a final decision, we separated in June and were divorced by October. I'm also the happy I've ever been in my life. For the first six months of my newly found independence, I spent my time going out and having a good time like I'd never had before. Brief encounters with many females, which proved to be highly beneficial to my self-confidence in the long run. Initially, it was nice, but then there was a pandemic. I'm not sure it. You were aware of it, and I had to put that aspect of my life on hold. Then a friend of mine, whom I'd had a long-standing crush on, asked whether I'd be interested in serving as her quarantine buddy, just to make sure that none of us is trapped at home alone. Then something happened that led to another, and here I am, falling in love with someone I never imagined I'd fall in love with again. The fact that we've been dating for a few months now has undoubtedly hastened our relationship in ways that none of us could have expected when we first started dating. But although I'm not in a rush to make any definite plans for our future, things are honestly so dang good right now that I can't believe it. She makes me feel so loved, gorgeous, and lovely that I want to spend as much time with her as I can get away from my work and family. Please understand that this is just a temporary situation for those of you who have arrived here at your lowest point in life, having been widowed and really miserable. Even if it means taking a beating along the way, love will always prevail.